Okay, the first thing we're going to make is a spider. First thing we're going to do is we're going to drill eight holes in the top of the pumpkin. I'm going to do this beforehand. Next, we'll take our pipe cleaner and bend it in the shape that you have in front of you. So you'll bend it, bring it over here, and then bend it again. Okay? And you'll do that eight times. Okay, now we're going to stick the legs in each hole and go around. So you can make sure they're all a little lower. Okay. Next thing we're going to do is put eyes on the pumpkin. We're going to take our Q-tip where we've put a little bit of glue on. Okay. And then we're going to take our eyes and stick it right onto the glue. Don't use too much glue because it's got to dry. The next idea we have is um, like a scary pumpkin head. First thing we're going to do is drill the holes, which I'm again going to drill at home before I get there, so this will all be done for you. Next thing we're going to do is put toothpicks in the holes so you can find the holes again because it's hard to find them once you start to paint. Next thing you're going to do is paint the top of the pumpkin. Just paint the top because we want this to dry quickly and if we don't just do the top it's going to get really messy. So just do the top of the pumpkin and then you can just go down the sides a little bit if you want in the down the ridges but not too far. We don't want it to again get all the way down the sides. Next thing you're going to do is sprinkle on the black glitter. And again, you guys are going to be putting a color uh, paint on there and not black because it's, it's washable. Um, so you're going to put the black glitter on top just like that. And then you're going to take your pipe cleaners and you're going to wrap them around your finger like this to make the curly hair. Okay? And then what you'll do is you'll pull it out a little bit and then you take out one of your toothpicks and then you'll see the hole while you're doing it and you can stick this in as soon as you're done, as soon as you pull it out so you can see where it is. Again, wrap it around your finger, pull it up a little, take out another toothpick and stick it in. Wrap it around, Pull out another toothpick and stick it in. And you don't have to have any more than three or four um, pieces of hair sticking up. It's all whatever you want to do. You have up to eight pieces that you can use. Um, next thing you're going to do is draw the eyes and the mouth. And I would use a smaller paintbrush for the mouth because you want it to be uh, uh, like a thin line so you're just going to do it like that and then I just made it a little scarier by putting the cross hatches in okay and then you'll do the and you can also do the eyes make sure you got a lot of good amount of paint on there for the the eyes so you can get the glitter on there. Okay. I'm going to pick this up so I can do this and so you take now you take the purple glitter and you sprinkle it on the new paint that you put on. And there is your eyes and a mouth in your second color. And the last thing you're going to do is put the beads on
And that's it. You have your scary pumpkin head.